Hello besties, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna do a what I eat in a day. Um, I've only had coffee so far, I'm gonna insert that clip here. Here is my delicious latte this morning. I went to Trader Joe's and got new creamer, my brown sugar oat creamer. Thank God I stocked up because it was out of stock last week. Um, and we're just gonna get into what I'm eating today. We're gonna have breakfast now. I've been eating this breakfast all the time. Um, it's just like a carb balance wrap with avocado and my egg whites with one egg yolk on it and some hot sauce. It's so simple, but it's so good. So we're gonna have that now. Okay, these are the wraps I like. Fiber, low carb, low cal, no sugar, delish. These are my egg whites you guys know I use. I'm gonna do one regular egg with my egg whites and then a teeny tiny avocado from Trader Joe's. What does the weather say for today? It's kind of disgusting out. Uh, cloudy, chance of rain, weather. Oh, what time? Oh, no, it's going down. Nothing. But I have to edit on my computer, and editing in the rainy back porch room with all the windows sounds really lovely. I think the shirt in black for brick, but they don't, it's not white lettering. You see, it's not as black and white. I think it'd be Where'd you get that shirt from, Amazon? Yeah, one of the, one of the other websites. <laughs> but they don't make it in black the same. Mm. How good are these new knives? Mom said the brand I got was really good, and she was surprised I got them on such a sale. Oh, yeah, I think they're good. Yeah, but I didn't know the brand. She said it was a really good brand. Oh my god, I, I literally cracked three of my nails that I just got done last week. Huh? Nothing. Oh, what's going on with my nails? They keep like cracking off. This manicure is not gonna last long. But I like my, oop, tortilla super toasty. It's actually not that toasted today. And then I'm just gonna mash up my avocado. With the camera. Right here. Oh. <laughs> Take my avocado. Put it on my tortilla. Fun fact, if I ever eat anything with avocado, my dad cannot call it an avocado. He calls it guacamole every time. Can't wrap his head around this is an avocado, not guacamole. I'm using the whole teeny tiny avocado. I'm trying to not be so hard on myself because like obviously like I've started looking at, at like calories of things and trying to like somewhat track my meals because like I just want to feel good and like eat better and you know try not to be like you know i don't know i feel like nowadays if you like count your calories that's just immediately toxic and it's like it's really not like it, it's just life you know like i gotta see what i'm eating i gotta see what's in stuff try to eat more fiber more protein and like not like go crazy with my calories every day so try to be good at first like i saw how many calories were in a teeny tiny avocado and i was like oh my god that's like kind of a lot but it's a healthy fat, so I'm letting myself have the whole teeny tiny avocado for breakfast. My salt. Now I'm just gonna scramble up my egg whites with one egg yolk, and then I'm gonna add it to the tortilla. Okay, I have my scrambled egg whites and egg. I'm just putting them on my, um, what is this, oven mitt thing? <laughs> so I'm just gonna put my eggs on my tortilla. Sometimes I make too much eggs and it just kind of like falls out, but then it's just like, okay, side of extra eggs on this then. You know, no big. Then I just fold it up and whatever falls out is just extra yumminess on the side. So that is like my favorite thing ever. Let me get my hot sauce. We'll have our first bite together. It is the best hot sauce ever. It's the Ocean AC um, Atlantic City resort, uh, well, I can't remember the name of it, casino. And this is their like Hank sauce collab for the hot sauce, and it's so good. And I just drizzle that on. We can enjoy our first bite together. Here she is in all her glory. Avocado, eggs, giant tortilla. It's so 
filling and good. Like, I feel like sometimes I watch people's video and be like, how are you not hungry after that? But like, really, you won't be. It's so yum. The hot sauce. Don't want to spill too much. Mmm. I'm telling you, it's so good. Because I used to like like an egg quesadilla, but the avocado is so much better. It's like creamy and once my avocados are ripe, I put them in the fridge so they always stay perfectly ripe. And like that cold creamy with the hot scrambled egg and the hot sauce, oh my God, it's so good. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this deliciousness. Yum. Finish my latte. I might make another, I don't know yet. Now that I have my creamer, I can have a lot of coffees. But yeah, that's breakfast today. And we'll check in later when it's time for lunch. Love ya. Bye. Bye for now. Hello, my angel girls. It is lunchtime, but it is. It's hot now. You know, the air conditioning doesn't really reach the kitchen very well. So, it was chilly, but in here, it's kind of hot. We are going to keep it simple today turkey sandwich and some potato salad for lunch. I love the Costco Trader, <laughs> the Costco Trader Joe's, the Costco potato salad and we have so much from this weekend. And then I'm gonna use this Schmidt Italian 347 bread. I can insert a picture of it right here, what it looks like. You can get it at Costco, stop and shop. I'm sure like if you have a Kroger or a Publix, I have it too. I'm gonna toast it, it's frozen. Toaster wasn't going down. I have a key lime LaCroix, so good. Benny's here, right? Here's a little pause. Delicioso. You know what's interesting? Why do they even make full fat mayo? I, I can't taste the difference. But then again, it's always on a sandwich. I guess if I like, oh my God, the thought of having a spoonful of mayonnaise just literally didn't want to throw up in my mouth. I don't eat mayonnaise on its own, so how would I know the difference, I guess? But the only mayo I find a difference between like regular and QP, QPI, because it's like richer and more like umami flavored to me. That's the only mayo I can really taste a difference, if I'm being honest. I'm trying to think about sometimes I just like mayo and turkey on toast. I mean, we have tomatoes. But uh, this one has like nastiness on it. Ew. I have one little Campari left from my last Trader Joe's or YouTube video, so. Or no, did I get more in between then? Doesn't matter. One little tomato, and I think that's good, just turkey tomato. It's this, and we have another one of these in the garage fridge. It's this. And the calories aren't bad. I'm gonna have two ounces, and this is when I need a food scale, but it's okay. I can eyeball it, and I know that Two ounces roughly is like, one ounce is roughly about two tablespoons. So, where's my tablespoon guy? Mom got these cute tablespoons that are like hearts for measuring spoons. They're not all tablespoons, obviously. Okay, so one. Is I, it's hard when you're like, I hate the word dieting, but like I kind of am, at least I'm trying to. On the weekends, it's just harder, but, um, I want to like use up the food we have in the fridge to some extent, so I'm trying to like incorporate it. That looks like too much. It's fine, whatever. It's the best potato salad. Like I could literally, I was eating so much of it this weekend. I could literally stick a spoon in this and eat the entire thing. Not very exciting. I'm just gonna slice my tomato up. I tied my sweatshirt up like a father of three. I'm just gonna thinly slice the tomato and put some salt and pepper on it. I wish I had provolone cheese, but I don't put on this sandwich, but it's fine. Love this sea salt from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna do something crazy. Um, I eat, I make sure to eat four ounces of this turkey when I have it, like that's a serving I'll do. And, um, I still haven't bought a food scale because I am lazy and I just try to like figure it out without. But I literally just will cut this in half and be like, well, that's my serving. And I'll just cut the whole thing in half. And then I know like each package is two servings for me. Toast is perfectly toasted. Do you 
I might only use one tablespoon of mayo. A tablespoon of mayo is kind of a lot. Oh my god, yeah, I'm not gonna. Well, first, it's like. My fork is clean, don't worry. There we go. That's kind of a lot of mayonnaise. We're gonna get the tomatoes down first, and then weigh them down with my uh, with my turkey. Because I find if I put the mayonnaise on the bread, it'll just like sink into the bread, and then I can't even taste the mayonnaise anymore. Some of the turkey off. And then I'll put the mayo on underneath. Everything about how I'm doing this is just giving amateur hour right now. Like, I really need a rubber spatula to get all of this mayo off my tablespoon, but it's fine. I see, like, look at all that mayo, and it's not like disappearing into bread and getting soggy, staying in between the meat layers, giving mayo naws turkey back on over it seal it up and if you don't like that don't do that I'm just doing what I like put the top back on her put it on our plate I did use a paper plate instead of a cutting board because we have them I have my turkey sandwich okay I was also taking a thumbnail sorry <laughs> let's take a bite of our turkey sandwich how good that looks. Okay. Mmm. Mm hmm. Really good. Best potato salad ever. Let's give it a bite. I'm probably gonna be eating potato salad every day for the next week. Because <laughs> we have so much of it. Mmm. Oh my god, that's good. It's so good. I'm finally done editing and posting. My last YouTube video you would have seen just went up today. And I'm going to try to post two YouTube videos a week is my goal. We'll see how I do. Maybe I'll do more, maybe I'll do less. Hopefully not less, the minimum is two. At least that's the goal in my head right now because I love YouTube. And it's time to grind, time to throw myself into work. 10 out of 10. Hello, I'm back. Um, I'm, I'm in like super comfy, like get ready clothes because I'm gonna like fix up my makeup. I'm going out tonight in a little bit, in a couple hours. Um, but I wanna eat dinner earlier rather than later. It's like six o'clock. Um, and I wanna try this new stuff I got at Trader Joe's today. I've never seen it before, but maybe I just like don't know garlic shiitake string beans and I thought that meant there were mushrooms in it but it just says green beans and a garlic shiitake mushroom sauce and they just looked really yum so I'm gonna have these with the baby go chicken cilantro wontons how do I heat this up we're gonna have like two cups of veg I think and then I'll put a picture of the baby go chicken wontons here they're just, they're in the garage for freezer and they're it's such a big bag. I'm not bringing in the whole bag to show you guys. I'm just going to go out there, put them in my bowl and uh, yeah, be right back. These are my little frozen mini wontons. Mmm. Mm. And then these are the veg I showed you. The shallow low bowl. For these. I'm just gonna microwave them. I'm gonna put a little bit of water in the bottom and then cover them with a wet paper towel. Okay, these are these are my said wontons. And then I'll do these in the bowl. So one cup and there's two and a half in here. Like two and a half servings and you know what, the whole container is only 190 calories so I guess I'll just have the whole thing. All right, is that too much veggie? I'm gonna cook them on the stove top I just decided instead. I know they're frozen, but they smell really good even though they're frozen. And they fit perfectly in my little baby frying pan. Wontons are almost done. And then that's happening. I fear today isn't a recipe cooking video. I fear 
it's very realistic very easy meal set this is literally what i'm eating most days so take me or leave me i feel like this is gonna be too hot to grab with just my hands let me grab this towel oh yeah these these boys are steaming all right let's check on my string beans while those sit to move my wontons over. They definitely, yeah, seem cooked. My green beans right here. These are nice and hot. Ooh, that's a lot of green beans. I might have leftovers. The sauce smells so good. I know it's not good to probably eat like frozen meals, but they're vegetables and the wontons. <laughs> Honestly, that looks like a delicious dinner to me and easy. My family is getting takeout. Theirs isn't quite here yet, but I'm hungry. So let's try our meal. Yeah, apparently focusing is hard for my camera, so. There we go, those look yum. Mm. Mm. Ooh, those have like a little touch of spice in them. I'm dipping my wonton in the sauce, because I have soy sauce at the, when I'm feeling lazy, I just put a little soy sauce on these. Mmm. Wow, with that green bean sauce, it's really good. Wow. Okay, yum.